Good morning, hot dogs. I'm your host, Ayla. And I am Lizzy. Thanks for tuning in to September 21st for your hot dog announcements. NHS, College Go Week, pictures, and more. Now, on to the pledge. Please stand. I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic of which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. NHS Senior Cabinet election results. Congratulations to Odalis Campos Vasquez, Daisy Santos, and Yadier Reis Roman for being selected as the three senior leadership cabinet leaders. All candidates represented, this, represented themselves honorably with outstanding leadership statements. Well done, seniors. How does one million dollars sound? Pretty good, right? <clears throat> Did you know that someone with a college degree will earn more, will, will earn on average one million more over a lifetime than someone with just a high school diploma? It's never too early to start planning your education beyond high school. Visit learnmoreindiana.org slash college to get tips on what you, you, what you can be doing each year in high school and keep an eye out for College Go. College Go events happening all week long at school. For lunch today, there will be rotini and chef salad. By now, you all must be wondering, what about pictures? Well, for seniors, it is Thursday, October 5th, and for underclassmen, it is Friday, October 16th. No, I meant the 15th for the seniors. Now, on to, the pl on to sports with Elijah. Hi, I'm Elijah. The varsity volleyball team went 2-1 to finish second place at the Hot Dog Invitational on Saturday. The team lost against Benton Central, then won against Park Heritage and Mass and Grant. The JV volleyball team picked up another win on Saturday at the Hot Dog Invitational being Park Heritage. Saturday, the boys soccer team partic participated in the Covington Invitational. In their first matchup, the Dogs lost to Faith Christian 0-1. Their second match of the day, the Dogs played West Vigo at the end of regulation. The score was tied 1-1. One one. Freshman Alex Castro scored the goal for Frankfurt. The game went to penalty kicks at the end of regulation where the Hot Dogs fell 3-4. Frankfurt is now 6-6 six six on the year and will play West Lafayette Tuesday at 5.30. The cross country team ran at the New Prairie Invitational this weekend. Crayol and Ace joined the exclusive sub 20 minute club, becoming only the third girl in school history to break 20 minutes, placing eighth overall. She is the only runner to join the club as a junior or younger. Three boys broke 18 minutes Daniel Pritchett, Angel Perez, and Josue Bautista. The boys since team finished third and had some exciting plays throughout their matches. Jimmy Osler won both his matches at one single, defeating Seeger in Danville. Chase Thomas defeated his Seeger opponent. In the second round, the Hot Dogs defeated Danville. The doubles team each grabbed a W. Sydney Caesar and Emily Shipley get to advance to regionals. Sectional play was this past Friday at Coy Coyote Crossing in Lafayette. Sydney came in third place overall with a score of 86. Highlight of her play were her two birdies and six pars. Teammate Emily Shipley shot in 95. She secured the last individual spot. The football team traveled to South Central last Friday. Ramsey Mitchell recovered a fumble on the opening play, and Riley Goodnight took our first offensive snap, 52 yards for a touchdown. When the D needed to stop the offense at the end of the game, they delivered. Riley Goodnight led the team in rushing with 216 yards and a touchdown. Sam Michael completed passes to five different receivers and threw for 177 yards and three touchdown passes. Jade Ayers led our talented receiver core with seven catches for 106 yards and a touchdown, and Kyle Earl hauled in his first touchdown reception of the season. Gabe Chavez once again led the defense with Ramsey Mitchell adding another fumble recovery and Reese Mitchell making some big plays on some fourth down stops. Ramsey, along with Vlad Carreras, Charlie Garcia, and Ethan Cook provide the final, provided the pressure on the final defensive stand to win the game. The Hot Dogs are at home this Friday night against Western Boone. Remember, 
I gotta give a shout out every time Jimmy wins. So nice job, Jimmy. Now back to your host. Thanks, Elijah. Happy birthday goes out to Samuel Morales, Saavedra, and Joshua Flores. This week is College Girl Week and Spirit Week. For the next day, for what the for what the next days look like, Tuesday, follow your dreams. Wear your pajamas. It's Wednesday, College Spirit Day. Wear something representing your favorite college or university. Thursday, your future is so bright. Wear neon. Friday, your future starts now. Wear school gear or school colors. Congratulations to Mrs. Palmer for getting the trivia question right. So sorry for today, but we don't have a trivia question. Don't forget that deca dues and cake roll forms are due tomorrow. The Student Council President, Giselle Gomez, would like to thank the Student Council members for homecoming. Well, for Student Council members for decorating homecoming. Thanks, guys. If you're interested in Girl Scouts, in joining Girl Scouts, you still have time to join. There will be a call out at TPA September 26, located at Shelter 5. If you have any questions, contact Troop Leader Cass Cassidy or Casey Tyken at 765-242-6036. That's, that's it for today's news, hot dogs. Make sure to subscribe and, and click the bell for notifications. We'll see you tomorrow.